Carson now. And uh, Glenn. Glenn McNeil. To make the draw for that print, the Mount Victoria print. And while they're coming up here, I would also like to recognize and welcome all the classifiers that are here today. The Terry County Show usually brings in quite a few of the classifiers. I think they enjoy to come here and talk to the breeders. But they like to see some of those cows out in the show ring, not in the show, in the show clothing, not in the barn clothing. And uh, it's probably a good day for them too. So they do play a big important part in our breeding programs. And without them again, we wouldn't have anything but any way to measure how an animal looks or performs. So welcome very much to, to all the classifiers. But they are here. Apparently I was told by, by their boss that they're here on their own time. They don't get paid like that RCM, RCMP officer there. He got a whole bunch of officers at his wedding there standing outside the church, but they got paid for that. But those classifiers are here because they want to be here. That's what the, the job of the, the boss just said to me. Okay, now we're moving on. Okay. One more announcement. The person that's being drawn has to be present to win that print. The gentleman is here. We'll see what he does with it. It's Mr. Peter English from the Holstein Journal. So this is a man who buys these prints and donates them, so we'll see what he does with them. <laughs> Peter? Now he's embarrassed. Come on up, Peter. I'm just I'm just joking. Thank you, Anne Louise. Thank you, Glenn. Well, here he is, the winner, Peter English. Ladies and gentlemen, I was just asked to uh, to make a comment about this. Uh, life is very interesting, and it's uh, the fact that Peter has just uh, won this print. Many people realize that there was a fundraiser for Andrea Crow, an industry colleague, and at that fundraiser, there was a Mount Victoria print that was auctioned off, and it was purchased by Peter English and donated back to hang in the barn, in Andrea's barn, so it would be there when she returned home. And isn't life interesting when Peter English wins one today? Yeah, absolutely. 
absolutely, as it should. As it should. We have one more uh, sweepstakes announcement to make, and it's the second East Gen $100 semen voucher, and this was won by Coxland Farms Limited. Congratulations, Congratulations Rob and family. Okay, we got Peter English here to say a few words. Peter? Thank you, Florian. Well, this is certainly a place in history, and I'm very pleased to be here. I think the first time I came here was the first year I started at Holstein Journal, which was 1967. I did miss a few shows in the 70s and 80s, but I think in the last 25 years I've been here pretty regular. But uh, congratulations to the breeders. As I said, this is a place in history, certainly a county that is produced many of the finest Holstein breeders in the, in the world, not just the country, but around the world. Thank you. Thank you very much. Congratulations to Peter on his print win. We also have another winner. This is a $250 uh, cash award provided by W.B. White Insurance, Dan McMorrow. And this was uh, just drawn. And our winning entry is number 103, which was an entry from class 13 for Warecroft Farms, Warecroft Samuelo Jupiter. So Warecroft is the lucky winner of $250 from Dan McMorrow, WB White Insurance. Congratulations. at the Ontario County Fair. That's a terrific, uh, strong group of aged cows here. And we have a 
real angular dairy cow to win the class. She's got that drape and sweep to her rib that I like to win with. She's deep in both her four and her rib over top of the real stylish cow in, in second. Second and third, similar cows in structure. It's a close placing. I appreciate the way her front teats are placed on her four outer. Just a little more correctly than the long cow, dairy cow we have in third. Third over fourth, she uses her femininity and flatness of bone to carry over top of the real powerful cow we have in fourth. Fourth over fifth, it's just, just a little more cow all the way through, a little longer from the tip of her nose right to her tail. Great group of age cows.